They were waiting on the king to come. The Jewish people were waiting on the king to come. As a civilization, as a culture, they were waiting on the king, but there were some who were waiting eagerly, and there were some who missed it. They were not even bothered to notice that he came. Right? And as we talked talk about before, this is not a quiet event. Right? Sometimes, uh, like I've said, we seem to kind of have this image that Jesus sneaks his way in under the radar, unbeknownst to everyone. That's not what has happened here. You had the miraculous conception of John the Baptist. Elizabeth was barren. It was a shame upon her and Zacharias they had not had kids because they could not have kids. John the Baptist was conceived. And then, because of that, you have Zacharias, who was a priest serving in the temple, struck mute supernaturally, and then upon the birth of John the Baptist, all of a sudden he can talk and he prophesies, announcing that this child is the one who is to prepare the way for the Lord. He's the, the herald to go before the Christ. Right? You have um, the visit of the wise men. You remember, just a week before all this happened, there was an entourage from the east that came through and said, hey, we heard the king's born, where's he at? Before that, you had the shepherds going around announcing to everyone, he's born, he's born, he's in Bethlehem. And they went all throughout Judea announcing it. These are not quiet events. So where's the fanfare? Where where are those who are looking for it, seeking it, and eagerly anticipating the arrival of Messiah? 